Okay, tiny texture here, and this is the stencil, and I cut it out, and I know it's <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell which which side is which side um, after <laughs> after you cut it out uh, from the paper um, after you use the dot matrix printer, and like I said, forty dollars for a dot matrix printer that does this this good of work is just incredible. But um, I told you that I would show you guys a trick on uh, how to put the stencil on and how to make it so that it stays on there really good. Um, I'm gonna uh, I'll put on a pair of gloves here put this stencil on and I'll put on some blue gloves do this with um, but and then I'm going to use the stencil magic here but the trick is, is now it doesn't matter how much of this stuff you guys use. I mean, just kind of spray it on there. I already, I already used the alcohol on it and everything. Um, just kind of spread it around, get it all over there. I already, I already uh, shaved the leg and everything. Just kind of spread it around there. Um, dry your hands off before you touch your stencil, though. Uh, just so that you don't uh, get it all over the place. Let it dry for a second or two. Um, you know, let it kind of sit in there for a second. Now, if you do use the dot matrix printer or you use anything, the easiest way to tell on your stencil is the shiny side of your paper is the side that goes down. So if you're looking at your paper, look and see which side is the is the shiny side, okay? The shiny side is the side that goes down to your leg or to your arm or wherever. And then make sure that you get a good placement on wherever you want to place it at. Okay? I'm going to place mine there. I'm just going to kind of place it in there. Okay? It's a good place. I like it right there. So I'm just going to kind of let it sit there. I don't want it to smear or nothing like that. So I'm going to take it off now. Um, that came out pretty good. Uh, now the trick is, is after you place it and after you do it, you have a wet, cold, paper towel, okay? Now, not dripping wet, but just a wet, cold paper towel. Just set it on there for a second. Just tap it, lift it up right away, okay? And then after you do that, have a dry paper towel. Take that dry paper towel and just press on it one more time, okay? Lift it up, and there you go. Just leave it now. Let it go just like that, and let it be that way, okay? Now let them go do whatever for however long or whatever. Now that's going to be on there for good now. Now it's going to take like a sledgehammer to get that off of there. Alright? Um, I'll show you here in just a few minutes that I'll find a place and I'll start scrubbing on it here in a minute to show you guys. but. Um, it, it'll be almost impossible to scrub that off of there. Um, uh, this little bug right here, it's kind of funny. Uh, that was with some of that glow, that glow ink, and that glow in the dark ink, and I went to test it out, and when I went to test it out, I dug it in too deep when I first got it and I had just started out tattooing and I didn't know how to do it and I dug it in really deep and I went in like 
oh god, probably a half inch into my leg with it. And oh my gosh, it was horrible. That's why there's like this great big brown hole right in the middle there. Because I went in like a half inch. It was just horrible. Um, yeah, you don't want to, you want to really be careful what you're doing. Um, just incredible. Incredible, incredible, incredible. Yeah, see it's already drying and stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's already pretty well dry. So, yeah, it's already dried. So, I mean, um, I mean, you can see me squishing my finger in there and twisting on it there like that. I mean, you know, it. It, it's on there. I, you, you can't you can't wipe it off. I mean, I just stuck my finger on there and you know I mean I'm digging at it to wipe off that corner there, and it is not coming off. That corner is not coming off. I mean, look at me rub on that corner. I mean, it is not coming off there. You know. I mean, that corner should be coming off there, but. I'll get this tattooed up here in just a minute. Um, I got some caps to set up and some stuff like that. So I only got like six minutes here and everything. So we'll get that all set up and get it all tattooed. What do you guys think of that? That sounds pretty damn good, don't it? Uh, it all didn't come out pretty good though. Oh well. We'll get her all tattooed up.